Welcome back friends and fellow meat enthusiasts. Today I'm going to show you how to make some delicious mahi mahi tacos. We're going to be doing it on the Blackstone Grill. We're going to make our own taco sauce. We're going to make a delicious refreshing cilantro lime slaw and also we're going to top it with a mango salsa. Let's go. First thing I'm going to do, take the skin off this mahi. There's a big piece of fish. Just want to get the beginning started. Yes, I'm doing this all for you. Using just the tip of the knife. We got a little separation to get it started. And then you use the skin and pull it towards you. Angle the knife towards the skin. It takes a little force to cut through it, so you'll be okay. And something this big might, might need to maneuver around a bit. Got our skin removed. Put a few aside that I'm gonna use for something else, make some black and mahi sandwich, kind of a staple here. Then these, something like that goes perfect in a fish taco. So here's a marinade that's really gonna enhance the flavor of your fish tacos. Start with some, some good citrus. We got mostly limes here, then a little bit of lemon. We just got a little olive oil here. Some finely diced red onion. Some cilantro. Then your seasoning. You can go a number of directions with your seasoning here. Do whatever you like, whatever you like on tacos. Uh, we mix up our own sometimes. In this case, we just took some pre-packeted taco seasoning and mixed it with some pre-packeted fajita seasoning. Smells good, looks good. I'm sure it's going to be great. Got it all mixed up. Marinade applied. We're going to let it marinate for about 30 minutes. We're going to set that in the refrigerator and then we're going to make a really simple fish taco sauce. Got a 200 milliliter empty bottle here that we're going to mix our sauce in. It's real basic. It's equal parts of sour cream and mayonnaise. Then add hot sauce. You can use any hot sauce you like, not too particular. About a teaspoon of garlic for, you know, something about this size. And then uh, some lime juice in there. And then we're just going to shake it and it'll be easy to apply after that. I'm hesitant to give specific measurements because most people aren't making this quantity of mahi all at once. Um, really, what's, what's the fun in having everything measured out for you? Trust the force a little bit. How hot should it be? Lime juice. And garlic. Smells great, real simple. It's gonna be good. Put this in the refrigerator till we're done cooking. Let's make a zesty lime cilantro slaw. Start with chopped up cabbage some olive oil, some lime juice, diced red onion, cilantro, and then just a pinch of salt is all you'll need. That's it. Onions in there, cilantro, olive oil, and the lime. Just give that a mix. Got that good and mixed. Smells great. Smells amazing. Nice and fresh. I'm telling you, you put this slaw on any fish dish, it brings it to a new level. Very good. We're going to go ahead and put it in the refrigerator. It's ready. What's a taco without some good salsa? We're going to make a delicious mango salsa. We took one large mango, diced it up, juice from two limes, one small fresh jalapeno, quarter cup of cilantro, and a quarter cup of diced red onion. Salt to taste. That's it. Simple, but delicious. Uh, 
I think that's mixed thoroughly. Let's give this a try now. Mm. So good. It's going to be amazing on top of one of our mahi tacos. Blackstone's good and hot. This isn't going to take long. Three to five minutes each side, depending on how done you like your mahi. Probably keep it on the full five. It smells really good. This is going to... It's gonna go quick, here we go. You want the best fish tacos ever? That's how you do it. I don't know if we got enough mahi. Tortilla, tortilla, poor line. Fish tacos have been assembled. We've got our tortillas, which have been cooked on the blackstone, giving them a nicer texture than just raw. Fish looks perfect, smells great. We got our mango salsa on there. We got our homemade sauce on there. We got our homemade slaw on there. You know, I didn't used to get excited about things like like mahi, like fish tacos. I used to, you know, pretty, pretty boring, just ribeyes and burgers, you know, still love that stuff. But I think the problem I had my whole life getting here was I was eating the fish other people were serving me, which was just blah. Put the time in and you get what you actually want. You'll find there's other things out there. So, uh, you know, nowadays, yeah, th this looks amazing to me. I can't wait to eat it. So without further ado, let's see what this is all about. Oh yeah. Wow. Those flavors. Everything together. Slaw, salsa. It's delicious. It's, it's, it's amazing. Everybody needs to try this. Well, guys. If you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. It really helps us out a lot. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell to stay up to date on what we're doing. Thanks for watching.